sliding down. This is all about you as associates of this company and the contributions that you have made to the recovery of the Gulf Coast region and to our company. And you are the ones who have helped us grow from $4.5 billion in 2005 to $21.5 billion in 2015. So well, the first thing was we realized that people had to have cash money. But after the storm, electricity is off, credit cards didn't work, debit cards didn't work. People needed money to buy gasoline, to buy food, to buy whatever they could get. And the bank was giving out money, a minimum of about $200, but sometimes several thousand dollars. And the customers did come back. People that were not customers they had come back, just people off the street that we helped. And you know we left, we lost less than two hundred and ninety thousand dollars. Those people came back and said, right after Katrina, you owe me three hundred dollars, five hundred, you cash a check or whatever. And they gave us that money back. Why? Public's honest. And they appreciate that kind of service. If the four months after the storm, because of what you did getting us back on our feet, this bank opened 13,000 new accounts. And we grew as much in that four months as we grew in the first 90 years that we had been in business. Holding the company's president and CEO, John Harrison. John? And as we began to fall low on fuel and water and food, support poured into the region from around the United States. Millions of Americans sent money, sent prayers, thousands of men and women in uniform, faith-based organizations, volunteers, and first responders poured into the market to help us get our economy back on a stable track. It was the toughest of times, but it was the best of times. And to the 3,900 associates who didn't get to come up here and sit on this magnificent stage to open the bell, I want to tell you that this is your day, this was a team win, and we are incredibly proud to serve at your side.